Well guys, Jenny and Andy from Norway have asked me to do this walk. I'm at Aya Triada and I'm starting here and heading towards the border. Thanks Jenny and Andy and let's go. I think this is a new beach guys, just being cleared, tidied up. Very nice. Lots of bamboo, as usual. And the path at the moment is quite clear, so we're good. Okay, let's keep going. If you have got a house or garden out here, when you're on these walks, you can come across some plants that are growing wild. You can always pick them. These are great. These things, I've got them growing in my garden and they keep the weeds away. They're really good, great ground cover. So these are growing sort of on the side of the beach. So was, and you can just go like this and you can pull out a little bit of it like so and you'll get the roots once you've got a piece with the roots take it in your garden plant it give it plenty of water and it'll spread like mad they've cleared this area as you can see and planted some conifers right along can you see a bit dark there you go, there's the conifers, you see, and they've put a bench, right at the end, Sue's on the way there, I think people can bring their four wheel drives here, or whatever, pickups, and just down there, I'll take you there in a minute. You can launch some boats. Got a clear view from Augusta from here. Loads of boats out. Oh, and there's some people down there collecting some sort of shellfish. So we'll go down there and have a look. Just seen the guys getting their shellfish, but they've just started, so there's nothing to see there at the moment. But we'll carry on down the path. Now that narrows down, so it's definitely just walking here. Heading to a secret beach. Yes, a secret beach. Okay. Don't tell everyone, will you? Oops, it's on YouTube. Okay, so there's loads of boats here. Lots of locals come here, launch their boats, and I think they camp out in the summer. But we'll have a look when we get there, eh? Stop for a little break, and I've noticed how crystal clear the waters are. Look very inviting you can get down there little snorkel there we are a little bit of a hidden gem I think just come across another great ground cover plant look at that you see it's spreads like mad and I haven't got this one in my garden so I'm just going to pull out a piece, see if I can get one with a bit of root. There we are, you can see the roots. Just put that in my garden. It's a bit of breakfast, let me just check for worms. No worms. Mmm. 
Delish. Right, we've just come across the next beach coming up. <clears throat> uh, there's the fishing boats and people there. And the boat launch. Right, this beach we've come across is called Marmia Beach. It's at Caparis. There's a cave there you can snorkel into. Loads of early morning swimmers. And a large cafe. Yeah. Nice little beach. There you go. And the waters are crystal clear. We're getting close to the border and we've come across a peel box. Peel box 7A107. Here we are, it's all locked up. Standing on top of it. Okay. Coming up to the next beach, some beautiful luxury houses, well maintained gardens with a lawn. Beautiful, unusual to find a lawn out here in this weather. It's called Fireman's Beach because the fire brigade are based there. We'll see that in a minute. Right, let's have a look at Fireman's Beach, shall we? Little beach, very tidy early morning swimmers. That's also got a little cafe. And over there, those buildings over there, that's the fire brigade. is the next beach where the schools come down and do some sailing and some after school activities there's their little boats there beach is called dog beach here you can bring your dogs for swim there's poo bins And all the facilities you'd like for your dog and yourself to come and have a swim. We've just come across another little beach, a little rough and ready one. Locals have put up some tents, sunshades. We're going to come up to the very last one that's available to be used before we get to the buffer zone. Oh look guys, we're coming up to another pill box. I wonder why they're called pill boxes. If anyone knows, put it in the comments below, please. Right, we've dug it out. Oh, it's a trench. Look, got a pill box, yes. There it is. Right, I'm gonna go down there. All right, it's gonna be a bit wobbly. Okay, so it's a trench. Oh, it's a trench for the army looking out. Looks like something you get in Flanders fields. All right, oh, the peel box doesn't look like it's been used for years. So this could be from 1974. 
Look, I'm going to walk all along it. You see? There it is there. Look. Okay. It's fairly overgrown, so I think it is possibly from 1974. The soldiers dug themselves in and protected this part much as I could. I might be making that up, I'm not sure. There's some more makeshift tents, canopies, people come down and have barbecues at this time of the year when it's hot. Right, we're at the very last beach you can get to at Caparis. People have made some makeshift camps. Yep. We're here at the buffer zone. No entry, no cameras. The UN are here just beyond the border. There's another sign here, it's the old one. Look, try, we'll try and make it out, shall we? No entry, danger area. What's the other bit say? Authorised personnel. Oh, authorised personnel only. All round here, close to the buffer zone, there's fields, they're working them. Probably don't want to build too close, just in case. And those houses you can see are, is Caparis. You see? Right, we finally found a boat launch. There it is, there. Public boat launch. Just coming back from the buffer zone come across this little cove great little adventure come down here climb down swim to the little island and then climb on top how about that for the adventurous got more places to come and snorkel crystal clear sea start off up there if you're a good swimmer make your way down to here okay. Doggy Beach. Come on in Woody. Come on. Oh look, he's been for a swim. Hello, say hello. Let's get the ball. Woody. Woody. Go on. He's a good boy. Oh, look at this. Look. And that clever little thing. Come on in. Oh, we've got another doggy coming with us. Come on. Oh no, we don't want to be on camera. Ooh, slip, 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 slip. Ooh. There's another one there. Oh no, the ball's gone too far out and Woody won't go and pick it up. 
he won't go out that far so I'm gonna have to go and swim for it oh he's gonna try and get it now no it's too far it's too far for me can you go get it okay I'll go and get it for you one moment Down. 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 Woody, down. That's the cover me crap. I'm getting to lie on the ground. Lie on the ground. Woody. Woody, down. Pull down. Good boy. Say to him down. Down. Yeah. Down. Down. Woody. Woody, down. No. Sit on the floor. On the floor. I don't think I'll make a good trainer. Yeah. Me. Woody. Oh, sit as well. no, there's a load. Sit. That's it. Oh, they're very obedient. There you go, one for you and a bit for you. Oops, I oh, you have to lock it, you okay? And a little bit more for you because you didn't have much, did you? Sit. Sit. They're not even my dogs. <laughs> oh, well, that's all your breakfast gone. Yeah. Alright, we'll have to go and get some more breakfast. Thanks for coming on that great walk guys and weren't the dogs fun don't forget to check out andrew's petra bazaar and don't forget to like and subscribe it is free and anywhere you'd like me to visit just put it in the comments below <laughs>